I am Vipi Chelvi from Betty and Vipi Meat Chemistry. I have started to give the videos from the AIMS 2019. AIMS COSI 2019 we are having 120 questions of that because it was conducted for two sessions. So all from the lesson of kinetics we had the four questions. All the four questions are with a different model. So in this video I am going to give all the four questions of kinetics. Let us see the first question. AIMS 2019 chemical kinetics. Out of four, the first one is for the first order gas phase reaction, A gives to be plus C all are in the gaseous state. P not be the initial pressure of the A and P T the total pressure at the time P. Integrated rate equation is four options are available. So since the place is not available, so I will just say let us go and find out the integrated rate equation. Okay, now let me write the first. This is the straight cosine. Our work is to do it properly. Beyond that, there is no extra plan at all. We have to work it out. So, given the equation is written, A used to be plus C. So, when time is equal to 0, that is at initial time, the amount of the A pressure is P0. It is given according to the problem. And these two are yet to be formed. So, they are in the 0 condition. When the time is equal to T, here the knowledge is, important knowledge is, P amount is converted, this is P is converted and that here, you have in such a way formed this important point, this is the knowledge. The stoichiometry is 2 mean, you should write 2 P. Here stoichiometry 1 mean 1 P. So what is it understood? From the P naught amount of the A, P amount of the A converted into 2P of the B and the P of the C. This is the main knowledge. Next one is find out the total pressure in the container. That, that is the pressure of the A, pressure of the B, pressure of the C. All are on adding. It is given in the sum PP. Okay, now here on P and P, this is plus and minus getting cancelled. Remaining P0 plus 2P is equal to total pressure. From that, I have to find out what is P. So, 2P is equal to, bring the P naught on the next side. And I want P, bring the 2 on here, that is cross multiply. Now, P value is ready. Now, again we are going to the, since the equilibrium is given as the, what is it called sir? First order. This reaction given is given as the first order kinetics. So, since it is first order kinetics, the formula for the rate constant is equal to 2.303 divided by T log of initial by left. Initial is P0, the left is P0 is initial and P is converted. So, initial minus converted is the left. So, this is standard formula. So, in the standard formula, we have to substitute the P from here. So, now you are getting that this is as usual you are adding log P0. That is your this P0 divided by P0 minus P. P value is from here you are substituting. That is PT minus P0 divided by 2. This is the P value. So next year what is our work is here. Here in this denominator find out the LCM. LCM is 2 and here it is 2 P0 minus PT minus it minus plus P0. Okay now your, the next level is you have to bring the next one. Of course I will do it here. 2.303 divided by T log of this 2 bring it here. So it is 2P0 minus of here 2P0 plus P0. So it's become 3P0. 3P0 minus PT. So this is K. So this is your answer. We had the answer. This one is the, one of the option was here. This is so this is I am selecting as an answer. Children, the next question is regarding the chemical kinetics AIMS 2019. This is somewhat interesting question and easy, tricky. This pattern we can expect. Okay, let us see the question. The decomposition of the ammonia, very important point to be noted is decomposition of ammonia on platinum surface is zero order reaction. The rate of production of, you see the Rate of production of or formation of nitrogen and hydrogen all respectively. 
and we you are given with the rate constant is equal to 2.5 into 10 power minus 4 liter sorry moles per liter per second this is the unit of rate for zero order reaction options are available the first answer is what is it called rate of production of nitrogen and this is rate of production of hydrogen with the corresponding units are there Okay, now let us see what, how you have to approach the sum. Very interesting and tricky. First point is decomposition of ammonia. Let us write the first this one. So, equation should be written in this format. Decomposition of ammonia. So, it gives nitrogen and hydrogen write complete balance equation first one. Second one is I am giving here general representation. A gives product here <coughs> if you are Write the rate law mean this is the rate law for this reaction. Rate is equal to K into what is concentration of A to the power 0. What is this one? We know it is the order. K naught we can take it as a rate constant for 0 order reaction. Now I will write here K naught. So what is this is the 0 order reaction mean A to the power of 0 is equal to this is equal to 1. So, when the order of the reaction is 0, rate is equal to rate constant. What is the thing I have, um, we have to follow it. Rate constant, we, are, we should consider as the rate. This is the first knowledge. First knowledge, writing the equation. Second knowledge, based on the 0, rate constant should be considered as the rate. Okay, now we are coming to the third step. What we have to write is, for everything, rate of the reaction is depends upon, this is since it's a teaching time, I am giving everything. So, this reaction, based on this, changing concentration of ammonia with a give, uh, divide by the time, that is rate of disappearance of ammonia, changing concentration with the time. Okay, it is decreases, so it is minor, and it is total matter should be given as a, 1 by 2. So, rate of the reaction with respect to ammonia is this. Is. Same reaction you have to express in terms of nitrogen. That is formation of nitrogen. I want the rate of the reaction with respect to a formation of nitrogen. Mean, what is the formula is? You can say the general formula for rate is changing concentration by dt. That's all. If it is reactant mean you put minus. If it is Product mean you have to write this as it is. This is the expression for rate. So since your nitrogen is on the product side, change in concentration of nitrogen with the time t. So that's all. There is no stock. Stock can be p is one. So this is with respect to nitrogen. With respect to hydrogen, change in concentration of hydrogen with the time. P and here stoichiometry is 3 so it is divided by 3. So this is again in the product side. So it is given as a plus. Okay now let us coming to the question. They are asking protection of nitrogen and hydrogen. So they want the rate of production of nitrogen and hydrogen. These two only they are asking. So in the examination hall, you need not write this part itself. It is not required. So it is for understanding I am giving. Okay, now you take it. Rate of the reaction. With respect to this one only what you write that is. <coughs> Another thing what is it? Rate is equal to rate constant because it is a zero order reaction. And what is the rate constant is given in the problem? 2.5 into 10 power minus 4 is corresponding unit. 2.5 into 10 power minus 4 is corresponding unit. So, the product, rate of the reaction with respect to production of nitrogen is this. Is. So, what is now the rate is? Rate is equal to rate constant. So, I can say this is the rate of production of your what it is called as nitrogen. Okay, now let us go on see 2.5 into 10 power minus 4. The first they are asking nitrogen only. So, this is 2.5 and this is 2.1 with the correct unit. So, these two are the options in between. So, these two are not correct option. Now, let us go to the next one. So, we have to go and calculate the next one, find out the answer. Okay, I am moving to the, coming to the next one. So, what is our work is we have to write the reaction with respect to this. Okay, how we have to do it is, now write the same thing. Okay, rate is equal to, you write this one. Rate is equal, let me write rate constant. 
that is equal to 2.5 into 10 power minus 4. Everything same. That is equal to this one you should write regarding with respect to the production of hydrogen. Now this is the rate of the reaction. Okay. Now what they are asking is rate of production of only hydrogen. So this is rate of reaction. Okay. What they are asking rate of production of hydrogen means this is this one only. This is the important point. This one only rate of production of your production of this is my hydrogen. So they are asking this one only. Very 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 important point. Okay, this is asking. So the what I should do? The three I have to bring it here. You bring the cross multiply. So two point five into ten power minus four into three is equal to. We can write as a this one. What is this is called the rate of production of hydrogen. Okay, now what is it? This one you just to multiply. What you can write? Ten power minus four. Yes, seven point five in the and its corresponding unit. Let us go and see here. Now our work is going to convert this and this. Seven point five into ten power minus four. So your option is B. So this is the very interesting question, children. Very very important knowledge is. Rate of the reaction is different. Rate of production of nitrogen and hydrogen is different. Suppose the again some other different question. If they are asking to this one based on this mean, what can be the question is find out the rate of forming. Uh, this is decomposition. That is ammonia is decomposed. Rate of decompose of ammonia. Suppose they are asking like that mean you write and write the rate of the reaction. So two should be bringing on next side. So this value into two is the rate of the reaction with the rate of decomposition of ammonia. Okay, children. So this is the very important basic knowledge. Prepare well. This is some the same aims to do some minding. Find out the time required for two third of the completion of first order reaction. If the value of K is given, so you take completion is two third is completed. So what is remaining is one by three. Okay, let us go and see the first order reaction formula study. This is two point three nine divided by T log of initial by left. Always take like this. This is simple one only. So now what I am substituting is we want to capture the T. T bring it on here. So the constant log of initial is I am taking as a A mean. One third is left. That is A by three is left. So A by A we take cancel. Now you bring the three here. So now what is it called? So log three. What is the log three? Well, K value is substituted from the sum four point three into ten power minus four two point three nine three divided by K value log of three. Log three value in the sum in the end it is not given. By the time you should know the log values of three. So log value of three is point four seven seven one. You are substituting. Next, what I am doing is just to this one. You bring it after the one digit. So it is multiply and divide by ten. So you are getting now in the denominator. This is approximately four point three getting cancer. And here minus four you are bringing us here. So now here it is a plus four. This one on getting cancer three. So this is one. So two point three into ten power three is your option is there. So two point three into ten power. You can see here ten point um, power three. 2.5. So we got 2.3. So nearing is this option only because others are only zero, less than zero only. So we can do it. Take it. This is the correct option. Okay, children. The last one is the last year 2019 uh, kinetics is. They are asking the the last model. What is the activation energy in the kilojoule per mole for a reaction? If the rate constant is doubles when the temperature is raised from 300 to 400, and the R value is given as the 8.31 from two standard value only. Now let us come into the formula. This is very simple. You can come into see the formula. Log k2 by k1 is equal to E. That is activation energy that should be calculated divided by 2.3 and the R. And this is the formula. Okay. Now let us. It is twice means k2. You are taking as a two. Then the activation and here you are 2.3 and 3. R value is given in the joules. Temperature is 300 and 400. Different is 100. Okay, this should be calculated. Keep it and cross multiply. So if your log 2 value is this is 0.3010, and if your you yeah, so bring it up. Next one. 
This is 2.303, 8.30, 300, 400 and 100. So this is two zeros are getting cancelled. Okay. Now let me write here. This is 0 0.3, 2.39, this is in a, and then 8.3. And then here it is, uh, what is 100 is taken as a 10 power 2 and 4 into 3, 12. So this is the way you have to do the, you practice to do it in a faster manner. So what is the next one is, this one on the multiplication you are getting 0.69. And this is 8 into 12, you can see if you have children, 12 into 8 you are having 96. That one I am having as a, here as a 100. Okay, into 10 power 2. Okay, now 0 0.69 into 100 is become 69. And 10 power 2 take it as a, this is two zeros. It is in the joules. They ask in the kilojoule. Divide by 1000. So you are getting 6.9. Let us come and see the option is 6.9. This example I discussed exclusively for giving this tips only. Because 8.3 is complete. Repeated is coming. Like that anything you can do. And uh, complete the sum as soon as possible. For time saving. Prepare well children. Time